Hi friends, I'm back with a gin review and yes, I've worked out the lighting so I don't have a reflection from my ring light. Thanks Steve for reminding me about that. And I'm a bit flushed in the face because I just did a workout. I'm doing the Betty Rocker 30 day challenge. If you want to know more about it, I can send you the link. It's 15 minutes a day, 30 days. It's totally free and oh my God, you work up a sweat. So I've just did my workout. So I'm going to reward myself with a gin. And I've been wanting to try this one since I bought it at the International Gin Festival about a month or so ago. And it is the Heathcote Smoking Chili Gin. Get that close so you can read the label. And I bought this. This was like the last gin I bought at, uh, of the day after three hours. And I was a bit hammered at the time. So I don't really remember it. So, But I did buy it. So it must have been pretty good. And I am partial to a chili gin. So... Um, if it's a chili gin, I'll buy it because they are pretty good. Anyway, so I'm going to try some, but I'm going to try it in my little um, measuring cup. Um, I don't know what to call it. So I'm just going to try a little bit first just to, before I put it on ice to see if I get a different taste. So, mm, yeah, it doesn't smell too spicy. It actually smells really... Um, sweet like honey almost so I don't think it's going to taste like that but let's give it a taste oh yes oh bit of burn yes oh yes I like that so I'm going to put some more in here because you know need a full full um double shot so this is uh I think about 45 mil this big one here None of this 30 mil business, not in my house. All right, so that's, it's a nice amber color. Obviously it looks a little bit, probably like a whiskey or something, but it's definitely not. It's very nice. So let's see what it's like with eyes. Yeah, it's still bloody hot. Anyway, <laughs> I like it. Don't know if I like it as much as the pants off gin. Maybe I need to drink a few to get into it, but it's really good. I really like this one so i'm going to give this one eight and a half out of ten because it is pretty good gin so i do like a chili gin throw me chili gins i will review any chili gin as long as it doesn't give me a ring sting oh all right time to go have a great weekend everyone and i'll try to be back sooner than last time i'll try to get one in every week now that i've got my fancy ring light and my decent tripod set up. I feel like I'm semi-professional now. All right. Bye everyone.